Welcome back to my channel, and welcome to those of you who are new to my channel. I'd hope that you would consider subscribing, become a subscriber. Clearly you're here, you landed here. This is a video, a topic, a product that you're interested in, and I have many more things to come, so please consider becoming a part of the Tico's World community here on YouTube. I'm not gonna bore you. I'm gonna jump right into this Irresistible Me clip-in hair extension first impressions review video for you guys and I hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to thumbs up if you do. Let's get to it. This is not a paid sponsored video and I was just simply sent this product to review it and give my honest opinion and that I will do. I decided to receive this product because I hadn't had clip-in extensions forever and I definitely wanted to give this brand of clip-in hair extensions a try. So I will list down in the description box the all of the details of the hair that I received. I'll mention things in the video but if you really want to know like every detail, uh, color, weight, and it's just in case as I'm speaking I trip up, miss out on something, everything will be in the description box. There will be also a 10% off cold, a link that I will link in the description box as well for you guys who are interested in purchasing these hair extensions for yourself. So make sure you check out that description box. So I received my set of clip-in hair extensions within three, three, four days. So came relatively fast after uh, submitting what I wanted to receive as far as color, weight, uh, and length. So I really like that just to put that out there for you guys. And so the packaging, once you open up the outer packaging, obviously it comes in as this beautiful black, matte black box. Very simple, but I do love that it is customized to the company website on the side, Irresistible Me, little pictures and symbols that I guess they decided that they would like to use for the, their graphics for their company which is, it's very cute, very feminine. And then on the inside, and I don't know, my lights are totally washing this out, but there's a little cute woman on the inside and this is, it's a very cute packaging, so I just wanted to go there, but to the hair. The hair itself comes in this package, which has a little pouch for the sample hair and this side of the package should be open immediately for you to go ahead and see how the color matches up and even how you can work with the texture to match it to your hair and then it also comes with little extra clips in here which i'll take it out in a second and then here are the rest of the wefts and your rest of your clip and extensions on this side it is sealed off and so if you do break the seals and you decide this hair is going to work for me, go ahead and rip it open. However, beware if you do decide that this wasn't a good match just from the little sample size here, the sample side or sample weft, then you don't want to unlock this. You want to go ahead and place this back and use the return instructions to go ahead and get a refund or an exchange. So this is the 1B. And the type is said it's Royal Remy. It's supposed to be 100% human Royal Remy hair. The uh, texture seems fine, seems pretty comparable to the texture of all of the other clip in hair extensions I've ever received that were human hair. Uh, it's definitely not perfect for a natural hair texture but I'm going to place all the clips in my hair and show it to you guys and we can all be the judge together today because I'm going to go out but I want to um, put them in and style them up and things so and I'm not going to do that on camera I do apologize I do not have time uh, and there's so many other clip and extension reviews um, and demos that you guys can pull up and you will kind of see. But, and here is the other wefts of hair. These are your other clip-in extensions. I'm just going to take it out of the netting that it came in. You can see 
The hair itself is pretty thick. Um, I really like how thick it is. And I did put in to get the 200 gram as far as the weight goes. So uh, the hair is definitely seems pretty full. Though everything is kind of wrapped in together. So obviously it's going to be thicker like this. And, but it's definitely a lot thicker than other hair extensions that I've gotten, um, even grouped together like this. It's pretty thick and I like that. So now that I've kind of unraveled the other wefts, I wanna show you guys this quad weft, which is just a four clip weft that is their signature weft for this set. You can purchase this separately. Uh, it is definitely, it's. Thick. It's like pretty much the bulk of the hair in this group of hair extensions, uh, clip-in hair extensions, and it's really great for those who just need like a little extra length in the back there. This would be really great, a really great weft to use to create or add so that you can do like a bun, a bun or a ponytail. It's really thick, lots of hair, looks maybe double might be dub two extensions in one it's a really thick section of hair and then it has the four clips obviously it's gonna fit really securely it's gonna give you that length and if you're really just looking for a little extra length in the back of your hair this special quad weft it's gonna be really good to you can just purchase this literally and you can like i said get some more length for a ponytail or some type of updo hairstyle. 10 hair extension clips. It's gonna be perfect if you need, for me, it seems like it'll be good if you need some, you can use all of them if you need some more volume and you can use like a little less if you really were just going for the length, which is what I will likely do. But I'm gonna step off, I'm gonna style up my hair, I'm gonna pass the flat iron over my hair um, and like a medium temperature, maybe around 300, three, no higher than like 320 or so, um, so that I can just blend better with the texture of the clip-in extensions. Let's see how that works. Hope it does. Fingers crossed, guys. I'm going to do that and then I'm going to come back to you guys because then I have to, like I said, I do have something to do, but I wanted to get this video out for you guys, so I hope you enjoyed it so far. I'll be right back. Ta-da! So I'm back. What do you guys think? I think I kind of love it. Like the hair, the color in general really matches. I'm so very excited about the color match. I thought it matched pretty good, but obviously when you kind of are just trying to compare, you know, there's like a little slight difference, but just not enough of a difference not to really blend the color color wise blends pretty seamlessly with my shade so i really like that the color of these extensions is true to a typical 1b here's how the back looks you can see but like it blends pretty darn well and I'm very happy with it it's full it matches the volume of my hair matches the color and that's really all like I can ask for when it comes to applying clip-ins just to have fun like just for some a little baboom you know irresistible me hair extensions a 8 out of 10 and the only reason I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10 is because so far the only things that I will I noticed and I've heard I've seen this and heard this mention in a few other reviews there are some like gray hairs that come on like mixed in with these hair extensions and I'm sure you guys could see it as I was unraveling them so I, I wasn't too fond of that it's not like a deal breaker to me just because um, I can either like pluck those few out or if they just really bother me after, you know, I can go in and I can 
literally maybe even dime just depend on how many and um there are i kind of briefly saw there it looks like there was just a couple strands in each weft so not a deal breaker to me but some people were really dissatisfied with that and you may be so yourself so i wanted to mention that and then there's a little bit there's like a medium amount of shedding now that happens i don't i haven't had any hair i don't recall having and i've had some of the best hair because i used to be a weed connoisseur <laughs> if that's a such thing um so i've had some different hair extensions and i would say that this sheds moderately you can you know even without like really pulling at the hair it, it has a good amount of shed upon, upon first unraveling it and working with it um but it's not so much shedding to where i feel like you know it's ridiculous so that too at this point I'm fine with and I'm kind of used to it uh, that moderate shedding especially once you were first like combing out the hair and so any uh, loose hairs that didn't um, that weren't secured in the weft or whatnot are gonna kind of you know come out so I'm thinking that that should be fine what I w would like to do for you guys is to update you guys either with another video or on my blog, which is uh, going to be listed in the description box. And I may list it here or I may just list it in the description box, but check it out to tcoltsworldblog.com. Um, I have lots of um, different reviews on there and um, style and everything else. But anyways, back to these hair extensions i will try to update you guys in one way or another you can leave a suggestion on how you would like me to update you about these extensions whether it be by video or just write a write-up on my blog um, with the pictures and things either way i want to definitely update you guys so let me know that will be all for this irresistible me clip-in hair extension first impressions review I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys think, well, let me know if you guys think this looks great, how it looks to you guys. I'd like to know your opinion. If you've tried these hair extensions um, or you have like any other questions about these hair extensions, I want to answer that for you, answer those for you. And like I said, there is a discount code in my description box below this video, right below this video and uh, the website link. And I'm going to list also just some co more company information, their social media and things like that. So you guys can get to know this Irresistible Me brand. They don't just have clip-in hair extensions. They have uh, styling tools like heat tools. Um, they have a great flat iron that I keep hearing about. I have yet to try it. I love to try it soon um a lot of people say it's one of the best and they have just other like um maybe curlers and things like that so they have a variety of things if you don't wear clip-in hair extensions and you were just kind of clicking on the video just to watch a video about clip-in hair extensions just curious um they do have other products that may be great and that you may want to try so go ahead and check out irresistibleme.com regardless of this review um about the extensions but like i said i'm at an eight so far first impressions with these extensions um that's major for me because i wasn't expecting much but i do love them so far i really really do so i gotta go i'm gonna go hang out and show some friends and see what they think and um i will see you guys in my next video and it won't be so long in between the next time i've been so busy i will update you soon Please check my description box. Thumbs up. See you in the next one, guys.